What's up, what's up? It's your man, Jimmy Chan. All right, a projectile is thrown upward so that its distance above the ground after t seconds is h is equal to negative 12 t squared plus 360 t. After how many seconds does it reach the maximum height? <clears throat> so, as I can see here, this right here would be my so-called maximum height, right? So this right here is called my maximum height. Actually, let's do it this way. This right here is called my maximum height, which is also known as my vertex, right? So if that's my vertex, how do I get my vertex from h is equal to negative 12t squared plus 360t. Well, that's easy, right? So first, because this is in standard form, I will have to first find the so-called axis of symmetry. So first, I have to find the axis of symmetry, and that's going to be t is equal to negative b over 2a. So negative b will be negative 360 divided by 2 times negative 12. So what does that give me? Let's see here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 360 over 2 times 12 is 24. So that's going to give me a 15. So t is going to equal to 15, which looks about right. I can see the 15 here. Looks like that's about right that the t is 15. But I'm looking for the height. So in other words, I'm going to look for the height when t is equal to 15. So that's going to be negative 12 times t squared plus 360 times 15. So let's put 15 in there. So let's see what the height is at 15 seconds, right? So that's going to be, let's see, let's see, let's see, negative 12 parentheses, 15 squared plus 360 times 15. So what I get is 2,700, right? So my max height is there, and it's going to occur at 15 seconds, which actually the question is asking how many seconds. So after how many seconds does it reach? So I didn't really even need to know what the height was. I just needed the seconds. So that is 15 seconds. So that is going to be choice A. And I hope that helps. If you have any questions, let me know. See ya. Bye.